Hey everybody, welcome back to more Pokemon Fire Red. And before we go on the cycling road, uh, this guy's gonna ask us if we've seen 40 Pokemon, and he'll give us the emulator coin if we have. But no, we haven't. Anyway, on with our actual schedule program. Yes, we're going on the cycling road, and there's a lot of fights here. And they're all with bikers and cue balls, and they pretty much carry mostly poison and fighting types. Bikers carry a lot of the poison types. Keyballs carry the fighting types. See, he's got a Grimer. We've seen this. Either way, your Psychic Pokemon's gonna do a lot of damage here. And this is a cue ball. He's big, he's bald, he hates you. And he has fighting types, and he has a Mankey here. We don't need to see this. We've seen Mankey enough. Well, thank you! He has a Weezing, though. That's interesting. That's actually very interesting. Yay, Mr. Mime grew level. He's trying to learn recycle. Um, I don't I forget what recycle does. What does it do again? Oh yes, it means you can use an item more than once. Um, we're not gonna take it. Nah, I don't want it. Uh are you coughing? Yeah, we can skip this. Feeling hungry and mean, and you need a punching bag. <laughs> Don't think you're gonna fuck with me, because I can tell you this. I'm definitely more powerful than you. You have a Mankey? Really? Mankey was interesting, like, at the very beginning of the game. Now he's boring. You don't need to see him either. No, I didn't, you blind fuck. What are you gonna throw at me? Oh, another Weezing. We've already seen this. We're cutting it. Do you think you actually could take my bike? I could probably take yours. You have a chop? Nothing we haven't seen before. Uh, let's see if we can catch anything new and interesting in the grass. Yes, when you actually get onto the cycling road portion, it's actually harder to control. You can catch Eradicate. There's no reason really to catch one, so we're just gonna run away. But, you can catch one. Yes, the cycling road is going downhill, so of course going up is going to be a lot more difficult. You're mighty proud of your bod. What's there to be proud of? You're fat. What, did you go to the Big Van Vader School of Weight Training? He has a Machamp! Holy shit! Um... I don't think we're supposed to see a Machamp this early. Like... There's supposed to be an evolution in between Machop and Machamp. And, yeah. Somehow he skipped. And how the hell did he manage to get that? Well, we're trying to learn Trick. And Trick is kind of useless in the, single in the single player game. It basically trades held items with, the u with uh, opponents. It's useless to us here, but it's, from what I hear, not too bad in actual multiplayer battles. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of trainer fight cutting, so... Yes, we are heading to Fuchsia, actually. You have a Weezing. Again, we're cutting this. I know some people are going to be thinking, why the hell are we heading to Fuchsia and not just going straight to Saffron? Well, this is just how I play. But, it actually does say that Koga is the fifth gym leader, so... <laughs> how do you know I'm not rich? I'm probably loaded with money. In fact, I'm pretty sure I am. And what do you got? You got a Mankey. Again, Mankey's no longer interesting. Send us something interesting, and you have a Primate. That is something interesting. Primate is the evolution of Mankey. And for if you need a fighting type, Primate is good. I know Mike is using a Mankey, and he's probably going to evolve it into a Primate, so... There you go. But Mr. Mime will crush his Primate, so... There you go. Uh, now we're just gonna keep heading downhill. What do you want? You rule the roads, huh? Somehow I highly doubt that. In fact, I think by the end of this video, I will rule the roads. You have a muck. We've seen muck. Muck, I don't give a fuck. 
I'd check what that sign says, but quite frankly, I don't care. What do you want? Well, thank you for asking me a very nice question. Hey, wait a minute! Well, you want a battle if you're just asking me about my bike. That's one thing about Pokemon that makes no sense, and we're just gonna cut that. Yeah, I mean, some of the people say really nice things to you, and it's like, oh, well, fuck that shit, we're gonna battle now. That almost reminds me of a, a funny story that happened from when I was in high school. Uh, okay, uh, I, I kind of want to be Rebel, but I can't because the game won't let me. You have a primate. Seen it already. I don't need to see it again. However, he does have a Machoke, so we finally got the Machop family complete. And Fira will do just fine because it's a fighting type, and flying types are stronger than fighting types. I don't get the connection with that, though. So. If anybody knows the connection as to why that happens, I suppose you can let me know, but, yeah. Anyway, I may as well tell you this story since I kind of hinted at it. Back when I was in high school, we had this assembly where we had these South Africans come in to talk about AIDS and stuff. And it was really stupid, to be perfectly honest. It was nothing but singing and dancing. You're bushed? Eh, I'm sure you don't have anything interesting, so I'll continue the story. So yeah, there was literally this one scene where the guy comes in and he's all like, sitting on the doctor's bench and shit, and the doctor comes in and he's like, well, it turns out you've been tested positive for HIV. And he's like, no, no, and then all of a sudden they just break out into dance. I don't get it. But anyway, besides the point, we talk. We now landed in Fuchsia City, and we're going to do a couple things first. First things first, obviously, we're going to heal up. We're not going to go to the gym just yet. We're actually going to take a detour to the right. We're going to go in here. Oh, look, it's another fishing guru. I actually do like fishing, and I will take the good rod. The good rod catches Pokemon that aren't Magikarp, basically. Uh, not the best rod you can get, but if you're looking for things like Goldeens and stuff, uh, the good rod is your best bet. You know, you can find Goldeens, I think even Poliwags. I'm not sure. I don't know if that's just the super rod, though, which is the final rod. And, of course, once again, I demonstrate fishing and catch nothing. So we're pretty much done here. Let's check out some of the rest of uh, Fuchsia City. There is a lot to do here. Now, you can get through Fuchsia a lot faster if you have Cut, but you don't need it. By this point of the game, you really don't need Cut anymore. The reason why I'm showing this market is because you can now buy Ultra Balls, which are the second best ball in the game. Well, of the normal Pokeballs. I don't know if the Ultra Ball is better than a lot of the custom balls that are in the next generation and stuff, but whatever. But next time, we're going to be heading into somewhere special, the Safari Zone. So until then, take care.